my name is Crystal Hall. And today we're gonna be trying the most revealing clothes from Fashion Nova. Here are the challenges that I will be doing. Day one, we're gonna be wearing an outfit in public. Word, bring it. Day two, we're gonna wear an outfit around a family member or a friend. And the third one, I'll be wearing my outfit in an unfamiliar space. Okay, interesting. My normal style is really honestly how I'm feeling that day. I am more on the bold side, but yet still prissy and preppy. I'm kind of like in the middle of like revamping my style because I feel like I dress very like t-shirt, jeans, like whatever, and like sometimes I'll dress up for the gram. I feel very confident in everything that I wear and I have learned to love my body over the years. Being a plus size woman sometimes makes it difficult, but I have learned to embrace who I am and to not be scared to embrace my curves and everything else that comes with me. I'm doing this challenge because I would like to set a record straight that you can wear a revealing outfit and it's just because you love yourself and you love your body. So I think I want to be able to find a healthy like medium of like comfortable and revealing. Ta-da! So now we are going to shop for these clothes. I'm scared! They like to put their most revealing stuff like right off the bat. Cute. <gasps> Oh my god, no, this dress, her coochie is literally out. There's some awesome fits on here. I've like actually never shopped at Fashion Nova before. I've always just been so intimidated. I feel like I would not be able to pull these clothes off. But you know what, we're, we're, we're letting that judgment aside today. Let's buy it, baby. Arrived today, Fashion Nova package. Here's the first outfit that I pulled out. Very, very cute brown, but it's just a different material that I've never really tried on before. I mean, it has some lining in here, which I like. Why did I sign up to do this? First outfit off the bag. So we're gonna call her Elizabeth Swan because she does give Elizabeth Swan vibes. Very much like cleavage y, love the sleeves. I was looking at it upside down. So this is what it actually is. Hello. Super duper cute. Can you see that detail? This is all in the open. Has a nice little V cut right here. So I think it's gonna be bomb. I'm excited. Oh, this fabric feels very, very interesting. Okay, so this is the top. It is quite literally cropped AF. Oh, it's very much a bra. And then this is the skirt that has like the slits and all. Let me give you an idea of how high the slit goes. This is the length that's covering my body. This piece right here that I didn't order, I don't even know what I was thinking. I don't even think this is gonna fit right, but it's just a bodysuit, but it's looking more like a thong bathing suit. I can't believe I have to post an Instagram with this on. My mom is gonna actually kill me. I don't even live with her and she's going to ground me. This barely covers my eye. Bring on the challenge. I'm about to head out with my friends. We're gonna go to a bar slash lounge and I'm gonna see if this dress catches anybody's eye or attention. I'm not nervous, I'm not scared. I'm honestly happy and excited to be doing this just because I wanna know the reaction that people may have. Okay, so it's the first day I'm wearing this outfit. It's the Elizabeth Swan shirt. I feel like semi-confident in this. I do feel kind of uncomfortable because I feel like if I lift my arms, everyone's gonna see everything. What I would wear this to, definitely when it's appropriate to go back. I would wear this to go clubbing because I think this is very much a club shirt, especially with like this. I get a lot of like early 2000s, late 90s Y2K vibes from this shirt. I'm gonna go get a coffee shop. Since day one, we're gonna wear this outfit out in public and I'm gonna try not to change today. Okay, so I'm out and about. I have my cappuccino with oat milk here sitting in this fit. I've only gotten like one weird look from one guy who's kind of like directly in front of me right now, so whatever. Other than that, I feel really good. I'm gonna post photo to my IG currently. Terrified um, because my mom's gonna see it and I think she's going to be mad at me, but at the same time, I can be like, it's for work. I have on the other outfit, which is the two-piece brown set. It has the cutouts right here, a lot of revealing. A little bit revealing right here, but nothing too major, but I'm super duper excited. But I feel like it's perfect for like a night out, which is what I'm wearing it for. So I feel like it's really, really cute. I love it! You love my outfit? You look so cute! The brown look amazing on her, like This is the day two outfit. Really digging the top, the bottom. 
I don't know how to explain this bottom. It is literally like, bam, slit is there. If I move my leg too far out, my entire ass cheek is coming out. I'm gonna show this to my friends. That's what day two is. I'm not wearing this with my family. Oh, Kimmy. Oh <laughs> my God. <laughs> that is so daring. Like, I mean, it looks really good on you. Like literally. You good leg. Okay. Oh my God. Okay. I'm gonna show Eli you, right you now. Have, you have to see this outfit. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what? I feel like he's inappropriate. <laughs> that's, a, that's a high slit. I'm uncomfortable. Are you gonna go out with that? Yeah, I, I am. Can you go on the subway with that? <laughs> I feel like your brothers are concerned. So I posted the photo. The amount of comments and engagement, wow. Um, Honestly, if the slit was not as high as it is, I would wear this like 100%. But I literally stepped outside. I was gonna take my photo outside in the front and I got immediately cat called. I was like, no, nope, we're going back. I don't feel confident in this only because the slit is so high that it literally makes me so uncomfortable. Like if a gust of wind were to come out, my entire, like the skirt would be gone. It would be flying up in the air. I have that constant fear of like, how is my actual ass out? Like, can everyone see my underwear? Like, is my is my coochie out? Like, what's going on? So, in that sense, I don't feel really comfortable in this. Yeah, this outfit was definitely way too extreme for moi. Okay, you guys, so we have the third outfit here, and I'm sorry to say, but I cannot wear this outfit out. Now, granted, I'm all for wearing revealing clothing, but this piece right here, which was supposed to be a bodysuit, it is just not giving for you, girl. It was showing way too much to the point where like I was spilling out, and so it just was not suitable for me. I am wearing this outfit today, and surprisingly, I feel so comfortable. I really like it, like a lot. It gives me very much like 70s vibe and I feel really really good surprisingly I thought this would be the outfit that I would feel the least good in and it's the one that it's like probably second after the white top we are going to go out in a place I've never been to before I'm scared I went to a bodega that I've never been to before I got some bread and I got some very interesting looks from the cashier he asked me if I had a good night and I realized it is 10 30 in the morning so wearing this outfit right now does look a little suspicious I didn't care I feel like uh Julia Roberts and pretty women specifically with like this little like detailing right here I actually felt really confident like I really really love this outfit and like I think what I've learned the most out of all of this is like confidence is how you act not like what you wear so I just had to like act confident and I Stop confident. Fake it till you make it. And I absolutely did. So I'm finally done with the challenge and I believe I did a great job. I believe I wore those outfits well, honey. Everyone should be able to step out of their comfort zone, find their boost of confidence and wear some clothing pieces or do some things that they normally don't do or normally wouldn't wear. For anybody else who would love to wear revealing clothes, I say go for it because you have nothing to lose. Well, the challenge in general was very interesting, very challenging. You know what I did there? I didn't think the clothes that I had picked were very revealing until I tried them on. The first outfit probably definitely was the least revealing. For me, the second outfit was kind of extremely revealing. I felt very uncomfortable, but I kind of like surpassed that and tried not to think about it, but it was hard to think about it when there was like a ton of gusts of wind out in the city. Specifically the last outfit, I was really, really nervous. I was like, this isn't gonna cover anything, but it felt super fun. I felt like a disco queen. I own the streets. The streets don't own me. My favorite outfit definitely was the last one. It was a lot of fun, very interesting. I feel like I can really push myself more. So thank you guys, I hope you enjoyed.